Mike and Shannon, most of us have witnessed it before. A car traveling slowly in the left lane causing traffic congestion. Lawmakers say not only can it be frustrating, but it can also pose a safety issue. So tonight they are one step closer into making lollygagging a traffic offense. Should have been done a long time ago. Drivers like Greg Murphy believe motorists should stay out of the far left lane if they're going to slow up traffic. Especially when they're on their phone or texting. They're in the lane blocking up all traffic and, and it's going to cause an accident. If you look in your mirror, you can see a line of cars behind you. So move over and let everybody, uh, let everybody go. Several states, including Massachusetts, New York, and Maine, have similar keep right laws. The House overwhelmingly passed the bill, which bans drivers from lingering in the left lane unless they're passing another vehicle. It only applies on roads with on and off ramps with no stoplights, such as 95, 195, and 295. This bill will lead to less congestion, better traffic flow, and this is a, a bill that's good for the driver, not bad. The bill sponsor, Representative Dennis Canario, says lollygagging can create several dangerous situations. Prohibiting someone from passing causes an unsafe situation for other drivers. It forces that driver into another lane and causes aggression. Canario cited a AAA study that found aggressive driving was a factor in up to 56% of fatal accidents. But a few lawmakers who voted against the bill wonder how police could issue the $85 citation to violators. This is completely unenforceable. I'm sorry, it is. So, Frankie, any judge that gets a violation of this is probably going to throw it out as unconstitutional. And now lawmakers have not talked to members of law enforcement about this bill. They also have not come up with a plan to educate drivers should it pass. The bill now heads to the Senate. Reporting live with the Mobile Newsroom, Kelly Sullivan, Eyewitness News.